Hey y'all, it's eight o'clock and I'm gonna do a demo tonight of the Explore More transfer. It's several small um, transfers that you cut up after you get them. Today, I got this whole box of subway tiles from my friend Tanya. She just remodeled her house and put these in her kitchen and they're beautiful. And I thought, oh wow, that would be super awesome to do these transfers on. They fit perfect. Um, this is one that I finished today and then we're going to finish another one with some more of the transfers let's see here I'm trying to see if I can watch on the computer because my phone stand that I got to video is not fabulous I don't love it but anyways but I don't see that it's up so give me one second Maybe I can watch it while we're going. Oh, there we are, good. That way I can see when I flip the camera around and make sure that you guys can see what we're doing. I don't know if you guys can see back here, but these are some things that I've done today um, with uh, the Chalk Couture round board right here. I did um, Make Money Beautifully, Ask Me How with the Chalk Couture logo with a little bit of an ombre. Um, super fun. And then today, I, I didn't get my big shipment in today, but I did get another transfer that I ordered. It's beautiful. Um, let's see if you can see this. It's Happiness is Homemade with a mason jar and some pretty flowers. I'm going to do this one on that big board that I showed you guys during the um, unboxing. So before we get started, I just want to let you know that um, everybody that comments Today will be put into a drawing, not just today during the live, I'll leave it up um, for the rest of the day tomorrow. Um, if you comment on this, I'm going to put you in for a drawing to win a free size A transfer. Um, and then I will send some paste uh, with you too um, to be able to do your own transfer on whatever you want to do. So let me show you uh, the rest of the Explore More transfers we have let's go explore besides the three i just showed you um say yes to new adventures happy camper and so the adventure begins wild and free i already used this one sometimes the paint will um stay on the outside of the transfer but it doesn't have anything it doesn't mess up anything so it's it's not that big of a deal uh, explore more and oh yeah super cute and let's see what all do you need um you need your paste of course and then you need a spatula or a um popsicle stick i bought these off of amazon i'll put the link below um they're like makeup applicator a small spray bottle mostly you need this if you're doing big um projects because if the chalk dries too fast it'll pull up so you want to make sure to keep it moist or you can put a napkin over it, uh, a damp napkin, but all I have are the bounty napkins and they say that sometimes the bounty napkins will leave the imprint that they have on their napkins on your transfer. So I haven't been using those, I've just been using a spritz. Then you need your transfer, of course, and Clorox wipes, not baby wipes, Clorox wipes in case you mess up because then you can fix it with that. I'm also gonna show you, I messed up on this tile earlier today and instead of uh, washing it off to sh um, and then redoing it, I decided I was going to wait so I could show you guys how you clean off the chalk if you mess up, which is awesome because you just wash it off and start over. Um, on the other tiles that I finished, I am going to polyurethane those um, because it kind of um, scrapes off. If it was in a place that it wasn't going to um, get touched or anything like that, I would probably not do it, but I'm going to put... Um, three more of these tiles together um, to make a big sign. So I'm super excited to do that. And then you also need, if you're not um, crafting in your kitchen, you also need a tub of water. I bought, um, let me see if I can push it over there to let y'all see. I bought a, just a white tub. It's kind of hard for you to see. Just a white tub of from the Dollar Tree. So that'll work perfect. And I'll show you how we clean the transfer too. Oh, I'm sorry for my hand in the phone. Learning all this new live stuff with you guys and now I'm crooked. So here we go. So for, oh, and you also need a towel because you have to de-lint your um, 
transfer before you put it down or it'll stick super hard. So now I'm going to turn the phone and turn my bright light on so that you guys can see and I'll show you how we do a transfer from start to finish. All right, as you see here, I have already done uh, adventure vibes in the never look back with the Volkswagen bus. I love this one. It's so cute. But as you see right here, I messed up and um, didn't get it all the way in the transfer right there. So I'm going to show you how we clean it off real quick. You're just going to spray it down with a little bit of water and I'm going to try and make sure I don't get on my adventure vibes because that one looks super cute. And you're just gonna wipe it off. How awesome is that? So you wipe it off with your paper towel. Then you're gonna grab your Clorox wipe and wipe it off. There we go, brand new. And then I will be able to redo that one um, at a later time to finish this. So I'm gonna dry that off really good. And then after um, my phone is wobbling. I'm going to have to get a new um, a new camera holder because this is super wobbly. So we're going to do the Let's Go Explore in the Chalkology um, paste in Peacock. So first you're going to peel it off your backing and always write on your backing um, what it is. That way you know exactly um, where to... I just got it notification up there sorry um, exactly you know exactly where your transfer goes and you cannot put it on this side or it'll stick so that helps you to know which is the front and which is the back so we're gonna peel this off we're gonna take our towel right here and put it down when you're lifting your transfers you want to pull from the top to the bottom not across because this is fabric so it's a screen print so if you pull this way and it's not coming off, it's going to stretch and mess up your um, transfer. I can't read everybody's comments right now, but I will promise I'll come back and answer. I see my mom's on there. Hi, Melissa. So this is going to come off. And we are going to figure out where to space it. And we're going to lay it down. And rub it in really good. Oh, I forgot to say you also need your squeegee. I cut my squeegee in half because most of the transfers that I got in my starter kit are smaller transfers. So it was a little bit too big. Can y'all see that? All right. So make sure it's down really good. I take my squeegee and run it over it. Then you're going to grab your paste. Give it a quick stir. It should look like yogurt. If it doesn't, I got some white that was a little bit thick. I just spritzed a little bit of water in it and, it, and stirred it really well. All right, so you're gonna stir it up with your spatula or your popsicle stick or whatever you're using. You're gonna take your squeegee or you can just use that spatula, but I like to use a squeegee. You're gonna take your squeegee. Oh, man, when I opened that jar, I got paint everywhere. Then you're just going to put it on your transfer. You don't want, I have learned today that you don't want really thick lines on there or it'll dry in a thick line. Super fun. Then you just get off all your excess. Make sure that you've got, oh, I just went outside the lines right there. So that's a super easy fix with our Clorox wipe. Scrape off your excess. As you see, you use just a teeny tiny bit of paint paste. Not much at all. And then I always just drop my, sque my squeegee in the water. And then you're going to peel it up from the top. Remember, not from the sides. From the top down. Let's go explore. Comes off super easy. Now I'm going to take my Clorox wipe right here and wipe up that paint that I messed up on the outside. How easy is that? And then you can take a blow dryer and blow dry it super fast 
and it'll dry. It'll be, this will be dry in just a couple of minutes. Make sure you put your lid on your chalk. And now I'm going to show you how we rinse off the transfer and then it will be ready to reuse after it's dry. Move everything out of the way. You just dip it in the water here and rub off the paint. Some of these pigments, the um, current jam pigment really stains the outside of the transfer, but it doesn't do anything to it. I've used current several times today and um, used the transfer with a different color. See, there you go. It's all cleaned off. Now you just take your towel that you had and make sure that you lay it down non-sticky side and you can let it dry or if you're doing a party or you want to reuse it really quick, you can just take your paper towel and dab over it to get all the water off. You're still going to need to let it dry just a little bit because some of the water gets in the screens, but um, after it dries, um, you're ready to reuse it again. All right, y'all. My first demo, oh, let me turn that light off. Goodness gracious. My first demo with Chalk Couture, I hope to bring you guys a whole bunch more stuff. Tomorrow I'm going to, um, I painted some um, clipboards for teachers um, with chalk paint today. And then I'm going to seal them tonight to make sure that um, the paint doesn't come up with the transfer. But I'm going to put the um, Be Brilliant on um, the back of those. I thought that would be awesome teacher gifts. Um, don't forget, if you comment, you get entered to win a size A transfer and enough paste to be able to do that transfer. We, I will also put the link to the website um, in the description up above. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you next time.